Hi lovelies, uh, welcome back. So um, following on from the, the clearing that we did last week, I asked what could we do that was just as powerful as that clearing last week, uh, this week? Um, what could we clear that would really have an impact on everybody out there? And Spirit said, uh, clear two things. Uh, one was unforgiveness and one was fear. And so I'm gonna do them together, unforgiveness and fear. I've done each of them before. I've done fear of things, never fear on its own. Fear is a massive area, isn't it? But unforgiveness is coming up uh, a lot at the moment. So we're going to combine the two together and do unforgiveness and fear. But I think we'll do fear again another time anyway. I think we've already done unforgiveness before or blocks to forgiveness before. So do look back on and, and the uh, earlier SRT playlists for blocks to forgiveness because it kind of falls under the same thing. But I just feel that the energy is shifting so rapidly at the moment that um, we've got really, really deep rooted stuff that's coming up to the surface right now. And um, we kind of need new clearings for some of the old stuff as well. So even though you might wanna go back to some of the old clearings that we've done, I feel that we're getting into even deeper and more evolved levels of uh, clearing now. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to clear unforgiveness and fear together on this one. So make sure that you're 100% open to receiving healing. It's really, really important because many people aren't um, to start with. Um, there's some earlier videos that show you how you can muscle test and how you can check yourself. And there's a, an old SRT clearing that will clear any blocks to you being 100% open. So let's get stuck in, shall we? So as always, this is a taster uh, session. And uh, this is the system downloaded by Robert E. Detzler. Do check out his books and the SRA. Um, so unforgiveness and fear is zero positive and 100 negative, unsurprisingly. I hope you can see this all right. I can't really see the charts. And in terms of consciousness, we are at incarnational level. Are we below incarnational? No. We used to, for a while, for a, uh, two or three years, I was way down, way down below the chart with many, many clearings. So we've come through that stage mostly now. It's why we also don't need to go into so many past lives now. Ten years ago, when I was doing this, past lives were coming up regularly to be investigated, but I find that they don't very, very rarely need to be now. So um, we've moved on such a lot, such a lot. Um, and certainly as someone who used to do past life regressions or trained in that hypnotherapy wise uh, many, many years ago, um, I, I felt the same as Dolores Cannon when she said in her books that Spirit told her they didn't need to go back into past lives anymore. And I picked up the same information around the same time. So very, very rarely do we need to do that now. We've moved on from that. Um, so uh, we're just asking the teams, your high self teams, to clear anything up to that needs to be cleared for unforgiveness and fear up to 100 positive down to zero negative and all the way up to radiant love and your paradigm level of consciousness. So I really feel this one's going to be another big clearing. So even though this is just a very short taster session, uh, it feels like um, I've said this to a, a client recently. It feels like I'm being driven by spirit to like, yeah, come on, let's really crack into this and really make a difference and really shift things for everybody now. So it feels like the uh, ante has been upped. <laughs> uh, it feels like spirit are, are like, yeah, we're in, we're really getting into it now. We're really getting into full flow. We're really moving through this hugely now. I feel a lot of a big push from spirit to to get these. Uh, done so um, let's really get this shifted for you unforgiveness and fear you've given me some excellent suggestions by the way I'm sorry I haven't got round to all of them yet and uh, sometimes I just get very very inspired to go with what spirit wants me to go with so um, I'm not ignoring your suggestions I've had some wonderful ones and I've got all the lists sitting on my notice board um, above me um, so I will work through them I promise um, but I have I have to go with what spirit want at the moment which is to get um, the most done for the most people the most popular and a lot of what spirit want will clear a lot of your suggestions anyway so okay 
So where are we going first? 6A, which is Master Programs. Again, I'm just giving you a little taster uh, of this. So we've got fear, abandonment, abuse, unworthiness. Okay, and do they have past life roots? They do. Do they have ancestral roots? Yeah, of course, but we're not going to investigate them. We're going to clear all of those master programs and any discordant energy there of all of those. Fear, abandonment, abuse, unworthiness. Clearing them away. That's all time and space and dimension inside and outside of time. All energy bodies clearing from you. It feels quite a heavy energy. So I may do a part two and a part three on fear as well. I may do some more clearings on that. Such a huge area, isn't it? I don't know how many of you are noticing the changes uh, now within yourself. I felt very strongly that uh, many of us were getting new light bodies now uh, and I don't normally speak in that kind of speak so but that was coming into my mind quite strongly new light bodies um, and that's why so many people including myself had a lot of illness this year as well we we're really clearing out the old uh, shifting some old dregs of energy that's why a lot of animals have got sick this year as well a lot of pets um We're moving through a lot of stuff and a lot of us are clearing for our soul groups and over souls and other people as well. There's a lot going on out there at the moment. Okay. Right, where are we going next? Straight to 10A, which is miscellaneous blocks, which is at God level of consciousness. All um, SRT practitioners work in their own way. So we obviously get trained. It depends who, who trains us as to how we work. But anti-time conflict we've got going on there. So let's just clear all of that. Just outside of time. I've had some interesting chats with people in the week who... Uh, trained many, 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 many moons ago and uh, worked in a different way, trained in a different way to myself. I just work in the way that I work and other SRT practitioners work in the way that they work and um, yeah, this is why it's, you know, you can never just have one practitioner to help you heal. It's good to have different modalities, different practitioners, different healers, different coaches. They all contribute. They all guide you. They all help you. They all support you in your process. There isn't just one way. I feel it's 13, 14. Yeah. Misuse of energy in creating. Let's just clear all of that away. And this is just a taster. So all the details are on my details bit. If you want to work with me, I don't do one offs. So I just need to clarify that yet again because I'm still getting asked do you do one offs? Um, if you go on my website, it lists the packages that I offer. If you're interested in an SRT practice, uh, an SRT package then um, I don't do one-off clearings except for home space environments I only offer packages and I have a frequently asked questions attachment on my work with me page for the SRT package so if you have any questions they should be answered within that you want to click on that I also do the one-to-one -one work where I don't use the SRT charts which is also very powerful 
use my other modalities. Right. We have a block to giving. That's interesting. Now, normally I would go and find out when that block occurred. But because there's so many of you, I'm just going to ask that the energies, let's have a look at the energies that go with that block to giving. Unforgiveness. Okay. Um, do we need anything else? To, any other information in order to heal that block? No. Can we just heal that block with that? So let's clear all unforgiveness in order to clear that block to giving on chart 19. It's interesting. So this new pathway is opening up for many people around the autumn equinox this year. So if you were waiting for confirmation, there it is. That's what I've been told. I don't know if that's for everybody, but certainly for many of us. Soul beliefs. Do we need to find out what the soul beliefs are? We do on this occasion. We don't always. Let's have a look. What are the soul beliefs that need clearing? Abandonment, failure, any others? Yeah. Appeasement, any others? No. Is that enough to clear the soul beliefs? So clear the soul beliefs there, please, of abandonment, failure, and appeasement. on this chart no anything else and again this is just a taster so this is just a fraction of a personal clearing acceptance enthusiasm self-forgiveness okay let's clear all those blocks away self-forgiveness enthusiasm acceptance Clearing those blocks away. Is there anything else on fear and unforgiveness that we've missed? Yes, yeah, still on 6B. It never lets me move on from a chart if there's more to clear. Gentleness. Anything else? Yes. That's it. Vitality. Is it endurance? Endurance, clearing endurance, vitality, and gentleness, clearing blocks to those. Okay, anything else? Anything else to clear before we go to a quick mop up? No, so we're just going to go to a very quick mop up. As I said, this is just a very short taster session. Just mopping up, which is where the bulk of the clearing takes place in the mop up process. So if I'm doing new personal clearing, then I have a very long list of mop up instructions, which is somewhere, it's there. But uh, I go through all the charts, the energy bodies ask questions, I have my various checklists, I have other charts that I look through as well to see if there's anything there, which are not the SRT system. I look through the healing charts, I go through, I ask a lot of questions. Sometimes a lot comes up, sometimes it doesn't. But this will give you a boost anyway, this will help you. This is still going to be stripping away a layer. How much it strips away from you depends on the individual. And some clearings we feel, some we don't. They're always working, they're always shifting stuff, but it depends on mitigating factors, how open you are to receiving healing, how much is running there that's attached to what we're clearing. Maybe there's many other levels and hooks in it that are keeping it anchored. 
maybe there's other directions you need to come in from maybe you need other healing to um, work with the SRT uh, clearings this is one healing modality but you know other healing modalities complement SRT as I say everybody's different some people feel everything others don't feel a thing everything's different but just watch your expectations on it really uh, expect it to be effective but don't expect how you're going to feel or what you're going to notice it will be whatever it is right it feels like there's something more yeah 18 18 is great higher level blocks which is where the lords of karma sit Blocks from the council within 2,000 levels. We're just going to clear those. So it's usually good news when we get directed here because it's time to release this karma. So it's like the end of a cycle. Right, anything else to clear? No, are we are we done for now as a taster? Yeah. So souls happy. Hold. Souls happy. Are there anything else to do? No. Okay. Good. Where are we now? Hundred positive, zero negative. Radiant love, new paradigm, fabulous. So as with all these clearings, uh, where are you, camera? There you are. Uh, drink lots of water don't do more than two of these a day they may be very small but some of them pack a punch they really do so uh, any questions put them down below anything you notice great to see the feedback so uh, drop it down below anything you, any sensations you notice it's really good to to feedback it's very very interesting for me as well um, as I aim to serve and uh, it's just fascinating how a small clearing can really pack a punch uh, with people even though it's, it, it is literally just a taster um, any further information any frequently asked questions go on my website otherwise I will see you on the next clearing and I hope that really really helps you lots of love to you all thanks for being here as well thanks for being part of this community bye